Okay, uh, so this is the second lab from uh, SQL injection. And in this lab, we are trying to log in by bypassing the password. And the given username is administrator. I'm just going to copy that. Just click on access the lab. I did that. This is uh, what I am. I, I've, I've already solved the lab. But uh, I'm gonna do that again. So uh, you could you could actually do this without actually practicing this through burp suite. But if you want to see what's going on behind the scenes, you know you could capture everything here on your burp suite and do it that way, or you could just do it on your console. And uh, to solve this, you could actually solve this on your console. Or you could either, you know, send the request to Burp Suite, capture it, send it to repeater, and go from there. Or the second way is click on login, intercept the traffic, go from there. Or you could do everything here on console, which is what I'm going to do. So the username is administrator and password we don't know. So the first thing that we're going to do, we're, we're just going to type whatever to password and click on login just to see what it does um, as we could see it says invalid username as password so let's just see if the username parameter is injectable to sql so the one of the most common ways to check this is is by having a single quote i'm just going to have single quote for password anything click on login as you can see, it gives us a different error message. And when you are a, when you're pen testing, right, you, your your friend is error codes. So you know most of the time, uh, when you do some hacking, you go through reading the error codes. So error codes are very important in pen testing. So, and that's what happened here. It gave us. If I go to here, it gave us 500 error message. So it kind of confused the server. Okay, I'm just gonna go back, administrator. So the first thing we could do here is we could have single quote, dash dash, which tells the server, ignore everything else after administrator. So it doesn't matter what we have here, it's not gonna read it. Because, you know, this, it says, comment it out, you know, ignore everything. That's what it means. And we're going to click on login. And there we go. We were able to log in. And the second way is, second way is just click on log out. Go to my account. Uh, administrator. Second way. What we can do here is we can have. Uh, so I'm just going to type it here and I'm just going to copy and paste it here because if I type anything here, you can't see it. So, so this is what we can do. We can have single quote or true Boolean case one equal one dash dash. I'm just going to get everything and paste it here. And if I click on login, it's going to log me in. So that's uh, another way you could do the, you could do it, you know, that's another way you, how you, you could solve the lab. And that's it. Thank you.